In this video, I'm going to go over how to get Voxel Plugin Pro for Unreal Engine 5. Um, so the first thing you need to do is go to the GitHub uh, and go to the guide channel. Um, when you've done that, you need to go down here, and this is how you access the uh, GitHub. So you just need to go through its setup to be able to access it. Uh, after that, we're going to go to we're going to go to github.com slash voxel plugin and I'm going to click on voxel pro and then pro beta LTS is the best Unreal Engine 5 version right now. You can also use the master which is uh, just everything uh, the developers are adding for 2.0 um, but it's probably less stable than pro beta LTS right now. Um, so if we have that, then we're going to download zip, at least that's what now that it's downloaded, uh, I'm going to go to my downloads, uh, I'm going to extract all, okay, now that that's done, uh, I'm going to open the launcher and we're going to go and create a new Unreal Engine 5, uh, project. Okay, um, this new games, uh, I usually use third person, so that's what I'm using here. Voxel. Okay, now that we're in here, I'm going to go to the uh, tools tab and press new C++ class. Uh, it doesn't need to have anything in it, and I don't care what it's called. then I have Visual Studio 2019 and when you add that class it's probably going to open your Visual Studio. If you don't have Visual Studio you will need it. Um, so I'm just going to click it and let's close that one and I'm just going to hit build. Okay, now that that's done we're going to get our Plug in. Uh, I'm gonna cut it, and then I'm gonna go to where I store my project files, uh, and then I'm gonna go here and create a new uh, plugins folder, and paste it in here. Okay, now that it's here, I'm going to go here. And we're going to hit refresh now if I build again. It sees that our plugin has been added. Okay, now that it's done, uh, I am going to go back to the project and open it up. Now, just to sh show that it works, uh, there's the voxels tab. Uh, there it is again, you can add a voxel world, all that. Um, one thing to keep in mind with the voxel plugin in Unreal Engine 5 is that it is somewhat unstable and it can cause it to crash. We can go to plugins now. Uh, let's copy it and I'm going to go to where I have the Unreal Engine version stored uh, and all the way into the plugins folder. And I can now paste it here. So then, if we go in here and let's launch Unreal Engine 5 again, let's create another new project, uh, engine install, and now that we're here, we can see that Voxels is right there, uh, and there, 
So basically, since you built the project uh, with Voxel plugin in it, the first time you can then move that built plugin into your engine plugins folder and it will work for your other projects. I hope this is helpful. If it was, please do subscribe and let me know if there's anything else you'd like to learn.